Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am just going to be getting ready. Not really doing a whole lot today. We're just going to be starting off with a Jeffree Star lower lip scrub. have been super super dry lately stay focused please all right um my skin today is a little on the dry side so i'm taking my pearlescence rosehip oil um i really like this as a base just to really hydrate my skin I think I need to change the settings on my camera because I don't think I'm going to be able to handle listening to this autofocus the whole time. Hold on, one second. Alright, that is a little bit better. I've got everything in focus, I hope. I'm going to be going in with my Benefit 3D Brow Tones. And just going to swipe this through my brows to define them a little bit. It's so crazy to think how Christmas is only a few days away. <clears throat> this year has just flown by so, so fast. I'm going in with heart shape tape, putting a couple dots down, and I'm going to be carving out my brows, cleaning them up a little bit. I have been so, so sick these past few days. My voice is still super raspy. And I've just been feeling like crap. It's been like what feels to be an upper respiratory infection and I don't know, not sure exactly. I think my package was delivered. Um, what else can be done aside from just letting it run its course. So today I'm going to be doing this makeup look. Um, just a dark smoky glittery eye and a bold red lip. Not exactly to the T but um, just to get the main idea. So first I'm going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Prism Palette and a Morphe M441. <clears throat> and I apologize for my voice, you guys. I still am not feeling the best, but I wanted to film and get a video done so I can edit for you guys. Starting to get a little bit of a routine going. I just dipped into the shade Saturn. It's like this really pretty burnt orange looking color. Next, I'm going into this deep brown shade called Parallel, and I'm tucking that right into my crease. I'm going to pack it on the outer V first, and just bring that in. Next, I'm just going to take a M224 brush, and I'm dipping into the shade Obsidian, and this is just a matte black. Fenty Beauty Galaxy Palette, <clears throat> and this is what she looks like on the inside, and let's go, I'm going 
to go with this color right here. And just pack that on top to start off with. I'm just going to spritz this a little bit to have a little bit of tackiness for the shimmer to sit onto. That is really pretty. But I think this next shade right here, I want to go into, see if I can brighten it up a little bit right in the center. And then in the center of that, I'm going to dip into this top white shade, giving it a little spritz, and then I'm going to pack that right down the center of that one. It's really pretty. Alright, I'm going to grab a makeup wipe and wipe off the fallout and put on some foundation and I will be right back for the rest of my face. Alright, so my base is on, just did concealer, foundation, today I used my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation little bit of Tarte Shape Tape and set that down with Cody Airspun. And put a little bit of bronzer from um, this Urban Decay palette. And I used Jawbone right here. <coughs> now to finish off my eyes, I'm going to go on my lower lash line with Saturn, which is right here. Alright, so I need to finish off my eyes, and I <laughs> am down to the very last bit of my Stila uh, Magnificent Metals. There is like just a tiny, tiny bit left. So I added some setting spray to um, add a little bit of moisture left, add some moisture back to it because it is completely dried out. And I'm just going to tap that on. Just to give a little bit more sparkle. These are coming out. So I'm going to go ahead and put on a lip, and this is, don't have my glasses on so I can't see, I'm not sure, this is just the Sephora lip tint in the shade 1 I believe. Alright, <clears throat> since this looks a little crazy at the moment. I'm going to go in with my Fenty Fly Liner and do some liner real fast. I'm just going to throw on a quick coat of mascara. This is Benefit Bad Gal Bang. My lashes. I honestly don't know what brand these are. Um, they're really pretty and full. I got them off Amazon. I think I got like 70 pairs for, I want to say 10 bucks. I mean, they're, you get what you pay for. They're not the best quality of lashes. And I have trouble keeping the inner corners to stay down, but they are really, really pretty for the price. 
I'm not going anywhere special, just going to be taking some photos and editing today so I don't need to have a super glam lash on today. But these are really dramatic, which I like. So I'm just rolling this side to side as the glue is drying to kind of give it a little bit more of a shape to fit onto my eyelash. I have been using this non-stop since I got it. This is from Essence of Earth Cosmetics and I got a five stack. Let's see here. I think I'm going to be using Sunset Beach today. It's a little too pinky for what I want. So I'll just do a quick layer of this. And let's go in with Fantasy. And the greens and blues in this one should cancel out. <coughs> the undertone of the other one. Kind of like that. I think today I'm going to go <coughs> a little extra heavy on the highlighter for my photos. That is the most blinding freaking highlight ever. Ugh. I'm still blown away. I haven't used this color very much, but the formula of this is just the more you buff it in, it just sinks into your skin and it just looks like glass. And it photographs so beautifully. Like, look at that. And it doesn't give you any weird cast. Like if you look forward, you don't see gray, you just see glow, which I really appreciate as well. <coughs> All right, I'm going to, uh, let's see if this is gonna work. Nope. Let's throw another coat of glue on. I love how a lash can just change the whole look so quickly. It'd be so easier if I could have found my tweezers. Alright, so to finish off my eye look, I just grabbed a eyeliner. I'm going to pop that into my waterline. And on the inner lash line. And then one final step, I'm going to take a little bit of this top highlight, which is sugar, wet that down, and 
and just pop that in the inner corner. And just graze that along my brow bone. So looking at this now, I think I went a little bit more dramatic than I was intending on doing. So I'm gonna have to deepen up my brows a little bit. I'm just running a darker brown shadow. This is um, parallel out of the palette. All right, you guys, so that is it for today's look. It's a very dark, smoky eye with lots of glitter, some nice, bold lashes. <sighs> Looking in the monitor, I'm not completely satisfied. Sorry. I'm going to dip back into obsidian. And deepen up this lower lash line a little bit. There. It smoked out a little bit more, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. This look can easily be recreated. Just use a black base on your lid, um, any kind of shimmer, glitter, eyeshadow that you have to top it off, buff it out with um, a warmer toned brown, pop on a bold red lip, Go a little extra on the highlight, and you are ready for a fabulous Christmas party. Thank you so much for watching today's video, and I will see you next time. Bye!